I live in a backwards nation. I would not utter the words abortion is murder, but would charge a man with double murder for the murder of a pregnant woman. What a travesty. Blatant hypocrisy. A nation birthed from the will to escape Catholicism has become as crooked as the Vatican, where the laws of God are marinating in pagan idolatry. Welcome to America. This is America. I'm an American. In the former form, I was one of the reformers like Martin Luther, or perhaps even more radical like John Calvin, thoroughly serving my generation like Martin Luther King David, a uh, possible prophet, but not an office I'm wanting. My mouth occasionally holds both the Lord's blessing and his cursing for you. My purpose seems to be encased in poetry wrapped up with impure teaching, but back to the backwards nation whose present flag is red, white, and blue. America, the beautiful America, land of the free. Home of the brave, nah. Land of the disenfranchised, home of the mental slave. I'm not blaming the politicians, the senator, any governor. The morals of the people dictate the morals of the nation. I live in a backwards nation. The shameless people are backwards too. I live in a nation whose flag is red, white, and blue. Truly a backwards nation whose flag mimics that of its former oppressor. Foolishness like the slave who chose the surname of his master. This is America. Welcome to America. I'm an American. I'm about to show you all my national pride. The flag of the future will be blue, red, and white. Blue for never bashful, blasphemous, and unashamed. Blue for bashing freedoms. Blue for depression again. Blue for down-home blues. Red for the blood of its prophets and the other righteous men. Red for abortion. Red for adultery, murderous bloodshot eyes, and strangulation from crimes of passion. Again, red for blood-stained minds. White as a disguise, the perfect antonym for the blatant darkness that's inside. Welcome to the future of America. Welcome to the future of America. I'm about to show you all my national pride for a nation whose judges set precedents only to overturn them with small businesses, Jimmy becoming big businesses, and big businesses have fantasies of becoming conglomerates, where even our subconscious thoughts consumed with every selfishness in the eyes of our youth are constantly staying red like t-shirts that are come in contact with pomegranates, even our excellences turn mediocre by the media, breastfeeding your lies and you're still suckling. And news anchors have all permission to find a law of imagination and we are checking where their hands have been. Welcome to America. This is America. I'm an American. A land of civil liberties and social injustice over sexualized and desensitized. When on any given day you may catch the eyes of a man gazing at the thighs of another man. And we have eyes long raptured by lies, longing to be recaptured by the truth. But our mouths refuse to call out for it. Wallowing in filth, swallowing any substance offered. Always crying, give me some more, but never checking the ingredients. Only groping around because the blinding radiance of our own lusts. Our money reads in God we trust, but we refuse to pledge allegiance to him. Welcome to America. This is America. I'm an American. I'm about to show you all my national pride.